What's up guys, it's the Couch Potato here, and welcome to the next episode of Ark Survival Evolved. On today's episode, we're going to do some really fun things, maybe with some dire bears, and maybe uh, some primitive cannons, so make sure you stay tuned right until the end. Let's get right into it, shall we? So, I made, went ahead and made up the, uh, the saddle for our new plesiosaur, and I still don't have a name for it. Um, I, I honestly don't even know what to name it. Uh, so, you know what we're going to name it? We are going to name it Spud. Yep, his name is going to be, or her name will be Spud. Just because I can't think of a dang name to save my life, and yeah. So, another thing happened. Um, just today, when I'm recording this, the, uh, the new map for Ark Survival Evolved came out, uh, the center map. <clears throat> and luckily... Uh, I can still do both um, single players, which is interesting to me. But anyways, on the center map, I um, I changed a bunch of a bunch of settings so that it would be a little bit better as far as gameplay goes. So, um, oh, also before I get too far into it, the shield that I'm carrying, I I leveled I got to level 80, and uh, it's an apprentice wooden shield. Talk about the worst. Okay, get him, Spud, get him. Talk about the worst underwater loot drop ever. A freaking apprentice wooden shield. At least it wasn't like a uh, um, medium crop plot blueprint or something like that. So, could be worse. But anyways, let me get right back on track. So, in the new series, I changed a whole bunch of settings around so that it would be more along the lines of like a modded playthrough. And so, with me doing that... Switching from a vanilla type playthrough, this, to a modded type playthrough, the center map, it's difficult to keep the settings and all the um, stuff in game equal. And so, an unfortunate thing happened, and I don't know how to change it. Uh, I'm just going to show you. So, all of my dinosaurs, their health got bumped up like a massive amount. So, Buckbeak now has 5,200 health. She's got 3,700 melee damage. She's got 200% movement speed. Like, she could one-shot a T-Rex instantly. Like, it's sad. And this takes the fun out of, um, like, a vanilla-type gameplay just because it, it takes the challenge out of it. The vanilla was supposed to be the challenging type, and then the modded was supposed to come along, and once you get dinosaurs, modded becomes really simple. So... I'm going to see what I can do with the settings, but for today, we're going to see how it goes and see if it changes it too much. If it doesn't change it too much, I'll write down the settings and keep it static throughout the whole um, vanilla playthrough. The rest of the vanilla playthrough, because I'm going to continue to upload this, this gameplay series. As well as the new sensor map, which I uploaded today, which is the 17th of May. So... Um, one, I'm very excited to keep doing the, uh, this vanilla playthrough, and two, you guys should definitely check out the new, the center map videos that I'm going to be uploading. Um, and chances are I'll be uploading those around the same time as I will be uploading vanilla arc, so you guys will have double the arc to watch. Um, but I'll, I'll figure that out, and I'll let you guys know. But anyways, enough talking, enough jibber-jabbering, stuff like that. I want to tame a dire bear, you know? Because we never got Dire Bears when the update came out on PC, and we had to wait so long f to get the uh, to get the Dire Bear and the Manta and the Lystrosaurus and the Arthropleura and all that stuff. So I think that's what we're gonna do today. We're gonna go out. We're gonna find a Lystro. We're gonna find a Dire Bear or a couple. We're gonna and we're gonna tame them up because I am a huge fan of the Dire Bear. It's a super good mount because it's almost like the Rhino. In that it charges up and that it gets faster and faster as it runs and all that stuff. But we got to find them first. And I've, I'm not seeing where they all spawn. God, I love shooting things in the head on this game. I don't know where they spawn, so it's going to take a little bit of looking. But I really do want to tame one. I don't want to tame a Manta because ugh, they're so annoying. They're, if I tame one, I'm going to force tame it. And we're just going to deal with it because I am not... Taming. I'm not aggressively, passively taming a, uh, a, a mount like that. 
Uh, I think it was a stupid mechanic, in my opinion. It was kind of a dumb, uh, blah, 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 a dumb mechanic to make it a passive tame, but to make the creature aggressive. So we're going to stay away from the mantas. Um, we have our water protection now with um, Spud and or Sheila. And, um, but I don't think we'll be in the water today. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw together some stuff. And then I'm going to go out and see if I can't find a dire bear or a couple. And I think we're just going to tame them out in the wild. We haven't tamed something out uh, in the wild. Well, that's a lie. We tamed one last episode. Never disregard that last statement. Um, but we're going to go out and tame a dire bear. And maybe a lystro. Uh, the little uh, little dog guys. The, the little... I don't even know how to explain them. They're like bigger than a dodo, but as the, the size of a dodo. So, But, you know... We still have to remember the fallen, so they're they're uh, illuminated by this drop that just went out. So that's okay. But anyways, I'm gonna go get some stuff ready, and I will be right back. So I'm not gonna kill it just because it's it's so innocent and it's just so stuck, and because really we don't need to kill anything because of the levels that we've already gotten from the the buff. But I just thought that was kind of funny. <laughs> He's just stuck in the rocks, just chilling. But look at the coloring of them, you know? Those are so cool looking. Like I want to I wish I wish that I could tame an alpha. How cool would that be to tame an alpha? Um I just think that would be that'd be really cool. So, I'm just out here flying around and I'll bring you guys back in when I find our dire bear. After an arduous journey and searching for hours, the wild female dire bear emerges. Let's tame it. Oh, she is. R oh my god, you see that ragdoll? Holy crap. Alright. Let's see if we can tame her. Tame her from up here. Okay, here we go. Please don't kill me. Hey, get out of here, you stupid ass bugs. Where'd she go? There you are. Jesus. Okay, there we go. Now we can continue with... Where did she go? Well, there's another one. What level is this one? 28. <laughs> Not even worth my time. Oh, there you are. Where'd you run off to? I gotcha. It's okay. I just want to become your friend. No. Stop trying to pathfind up here. It's not gonna work. Stop it. Okay? Stop it. I'm missing all of those shots. There we go. Perfect. Stay right there. Let me just nail you in the head. Yes, take solace with your turtle friend. Yeah, I had to do a wipe, like, of the whole, like, single player area to, uh, get these things to spawn in. So, I don't know what's going on. I even had to make sure that uh, the Dire Bears did, in fact, come in this update. Um, that thing's almost dead. Is it unconscious? Have I been killing it this whole... No, okay, no. Um, I'm kind of afraid to shoot it again. Excuse me. Um, I'm gonna kill this thing. And I don't want to kill it. It might be because I'm using a journeyman crossbow. Come on, get sleepy. Okay, now our friend's involved. Yeah, suck on that. How you feel about that? Oh, they're adorable. Look at their little faces. This one's all bloody. God. Looks like something out of a horror movie. Alright, I'm gonna shoot it one more time in the face. Get knocked out. Come on. Whoa, one more time. Ah! Dang it. Okay, well. Should we even try with this one? I'm gonna try. We wanna get a dire bear. 
It shouldn't take that many. Darn it. Hope I don't kill this one. How much torpor do these dang things have? What you biting at? You biting the rock? You're gonna hurt your tooth. This turtle is just chilling. Yeah, run away. How many freaking arrows is this gonna take? I don't want to shoot it again. I'm going to kill it. And she's down. Or he. Or whatever it is. And now we need to get some meat on her. It. Him. Oh, how close to death was this thing? Good God. Do these guys give prime? No, they don't. Darn it. Watch the taming effectiveness be, like, terrible on this because I was shooting bullets in his face. <laughs> I'm gonna laugh if it is. Let's see. Come on, take your first bite. Oh, oh, they eat very slow. That sucks. Alright, well, let me see if I can't get some pri- What the heck are you looking at, turtle face? You better keep walking. Yeah, that's right. You're lucky I- couldn't shoot you in a moment's notice. Stupid turtle. Get away from my team. This one too, he's really making me angry. He's looking at he's looking at me with those beady eyes. Alright. Uh so Holy cow, they eat very slow. And their torpor drops pretty pretty quick, actually. So I'm gonna have to sit here and watch this for a little while. Which is fine. I just dropped two hundred pelt. Oh whatever. Alright, so yeah, I'm going to sit here and watch uh, the bear, and hopefully in the next hour or so, we're going to have a dire bear, guys, and I'm super excited about that, because I love the dire bear so much. It's such a cool mount, plus bears are super cool. So, uh, I think after we get this bear, we're going to go and test out the cannon, because uh, I want to shoot some stuff with a cannon. Whether it, Oh man, that's going to take a little while. Whether it's a wall or another dinosaur or something like that, maybe we'll sacrifice one of our dinos and put him in front of a cannon. I don't know. I'm crazy like that. So I'll be right back once she is <clears throat> once he is all tamed up. Oh, good morning. What a beautiful morning it is with our brand new dire bear. Look at how cute he is. So he tamed out at 2,000 health. Holy stamina. 900 stamina. Um, 780 weight. That's pretty good. And 574 melee damage. And 467% movement speed? What are you on? Speed? Did you take cocaine before you tamed out? Okay. Well, we'll let it slide this time. So, I don't know what I want to name him. Again, I'm so indecisive with these freaking names. I If I ever have a child, it's it's going to be named like... Generic baby number one. I don't know. It's it's weird. So, unfortunately, you cannot pick up dire bears with an RG. So, let me show you where we're at. There's me. There's home. I'll see you guys back when my 10-hour uh, journey is uh, is over. Be right back. So, I'm just about home with the new bear. And uh, he's all banged up, he's all bloodied and bruised, because he's gotten a bunch of experience. If you'll see, he's now up to 5,200 health and like 3,000 melee damage. And like I said, I don't know how I can fix that. So, but I was, uh, we were walking through the water, and uh, I completely forgot about these guys. Check this out. These are the new, these are the new fish, saber-toothed salmon. But look at how big he is. Like, that is a big fish. Here's another one. Holy crap. 
Now, I think they give you fish meat, I want to say. Yeah, there we go. But now the other one's going to start attacking me, I think. Maybe not. Oh, that's lucky. Oh, nope, I was right. Oh, Jesus, there's two. Ah! What is that? They break my bones? That's interesting. So let's see. Yep, there you go. Okay, that's... Oh, you know what? I forgot to turn down the gather rate, too, so I'll just throw all that stuff out. But, um... Yeah, it gives you fish meat. Look at that. Let's see, it gives you... Raw fish and raw prime fish meat. Eating raw food will slightly sate hunger. Interesting. I wonder what dinos like this. I would imagine sea creatures. Oh, I also killed an alpha T-Rex. Um, so, that was interesting. But I'm going to drop all this fish food. I'll probably just keep 20 of 20. I'll, let me restart that. I'll probably just keep 20 of the raw fish and just drop all the prime because... I figure it's the same as regular Prime, it just spoils really quickly, yeah. Um, so we'll just keep that. But yeah, so we're almost home, but I just figured I'd come in and show you guys those fish, because they look super cool. Very dangerous, but super cool. So I'll bring you guys back in when uh, I've got them all saddled up. Be right back. Well, hello there. I just tamed a Lystro. Look at how cute he is. Oh, Look at him. I want to pet it. Oh, he did the flip. Look at how cute he is. Oh, look at it. Look at it. It's just a dog. Oh, you're so cute. All right, let's put some berries on you so you don't starve, so we don't have to bury you too. As morbid as that is. All right, and uh, we'll go ahead and keep you. We'll keep you right here. So, I found him on the way home. And, uh, I also, uh, where is it? Oh, there he is. Also, saddled up our new dire bear. He's a little, still a little hurt, but check it out. He's got a little roar. Whee! I think that's so funny. And then he's got two attacks. So he's got the little swipe that he can harvest stuff with and kill stuff with. And then he's got his little, he's got a, uh, a little bite. That he can chomp down on people with. So, pretty cool. Pretty cool mount. I love these guys. Because, I mean, look. He can get super fast over time. Whee! I mean, he gets up. He gets going. That is super fast. And he's really easy to control. Like, he turns on a dime. Whee! But, I, uh... We'll just leave you here. I also just uh, learned the cannon blueprint. I, This thing is so expensive. W look at how expensive this thing is. We can build it, and we're going to. I just built it. So, 950 metal ingots, 200 fiber, 150 hide, 120 thatch, and 300 cementing paste for a freaking cannon that you can't even pick up absolutely ridiculous but whatever and I do think no okay I think something is coming for dodos and like dung beetles where you can pick them up which is kind of cool uh, but we're gonna test this dodo out or I'm gonna test this cannon out on one of our dodos so let's see I'm gonna play can only place on floors? Are you serious? Oh, Ark, how you vex me. Oh, okay, um... I'll be right back. Let me go build a foundation or, like, a testing area for us to massacre a dodo. I'll be right back. Okay, so the official scariest thing just happened to me. Um... That's a Giga. And he's stuck in the mountain. And he's... Oh, God. Now he's not stuck. Oh, Jesus. That was a big bite. And now he's loose. Now I done did it. Now I done screwed us all up. Um, This is the mountain that... Here, let me show you. So, I'm here. Okay. Giga here. 
Giga there. House right there where that little cliff is at. That is way too close for comfort for me right now. So we have one of two options. One, tame it and try and, try and tame it and probably die a million times trying to do it. Two, we have three options. Did I say two or three? Uh, we have three options. One, tame it. Two, kill it, which I don't even know how to kill a Giga. Or three, get the hell out of the north and move to the south. Um, so, I don't know what we're going to do. But I need to get obsidian because apparently the cannonballs, they take three obsidian or 30 obsidian or something, a crazy amount of obsidian for each cannonball. So I've got the uh, the cannon set up back at the, uh, the base. And... Uh, Wait till you see the test subject. Uh, it's actually kind of sad. So I'm going to see if I can't find some obsidian up here. And then I'll meet you back when we're at the shooting range. I'll be right back. And as we loom on this dodo's last days on arc, let's load the cannonball in. Okay. Now, is the trajectory correct? Is that going to be a direct hit? Or, aim down. Is that going to be a direct hit? You know what? We're going to shoot that one. Here goes nothing, guys. Three, two, one. No! We missed it! Oh! Oh, so many materials gone just for one cannonball. Oh, it's such a waste to use cannons. Holy crap, but we had the trajectory, tra oh, that's a hard word to say, trajectory right, but you get to live to fight another day, Dodo level 88, yep, you do. And on that note, I think I'm going to go ahead and call the episode there, guys. So, we got quite a bit done today. We uh, we tamed a tire bear, we tamed a lystro, we tamed... Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's all we tamed. Uh, we got to see the new Sabertooth Salmon. Uh, we got to finally test out the new cannon. Um, and it's not worth it, in my opinion. Um, let's see. We found a Giga that is scaring me. It's it's up there on the mountain. It actually almost was... It almost ate the Mobile Forge and the Anki that we had up there. But I, I was able to move him down a little bit. Um, lure him away from them. So... They're safe. I hope nothing's safe on Ark. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. If you did, make sure you smash that like button and subscribe for more daily videos. And I will see you guys in the next video. Yeah.